We were an American company, and uh, we were we had three founders, and uh, we were uh, not perhaps the smartest guys in the world, but we were uh, had a, had a great sense of urgency, and we're thinking about what is going to make our business more valuable. Of course, since we were privately financed, our horizons were defined by the by the the, uh, the financing that we had. Um, in '89, the wall came down. Uh, I had been obviously in the military, so this was something that we were very aware of uh, when it happened. Uh, and uh, we we thought through and just resolved the philosophy that the farther you were from the U.S., probably the more you could make as a distributor because the more value you're bringing to the vendor. And uh, uh, we were in Canada. We expanded nicely in Canada. Uh, we, by leap of relationship, were invited into Australia, and uh, by leap of relationship, were invited into China, and struggled, frankly, to manage that whole uh, execution from currency perspective, import, export. Uh, we were learning as we were going. Uh, when Data Tech arrived on the scene, we were out looking for uh, financing. Uh, we wanted to grow faster, we were limited uh, to the extent that we could finance a growing business and we were prepared at that time to take on a finance, financial partner. Uh, Datatech's proposition was to make this an international brand uh, by continuing to leverage uh, their ability to raise capital and make acquisitions and then bring those companies together under the Westcon brand. So it was very odd and uh, uh, it was very odd that that coincidence occurred because we were very... Uh, open at that particular point to just changing the strategy of the company and trying to take that step up. And in comes a company from South Africa with the wherewithal and, and actually the worldliness, uh, because we were still three fellows from New York, although po Roman was born in Poland, uh, the scope of our business experience was here in the U.S. and those smaller ventures we had outside the country. So that worked very well. I can say after this number of years <laughs> uh, that uh, truly the partnership with Dative Text was great and they brought to the table what they said they would bring to the table which was capital, uh, international expertise and then uh, a series of acquisitions that would build a global brand.